गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हेयर आई एम कंटिन्यूंग चैप्टर थर्ड एम एस वर्ड एंड द टूडेज टॉपिक इज इंसर्टिंग ग्राफिक्स इन एम एस वर्ड सो देर आर टू देर आर टू मेथड फॉर इंसर्टिंग आ ग्राफिक्स इन योर डॉक्यूमेंट नंबर फर्स्ट वी कैन इंसर्ट अ ग्राफिक्स फ्रॉम अ ड्राइंग ऑब्जेक्ट द ड्राइंग ऑब्जेक्ट टूल वॉज इज प्लेस ऑन द एट द बॉटम ऑफ द एम एस वर्ड एप्लीकेशन दिस कंटेन्स द ऑटो सेव्स कर्स लाइन्स एंड वर्ड आर्ट आर द ड्राइंग्स एंड सेकेंडली वी कैन इंसर्ट आ सम ग्राफिक्स फ्रॉम द पिक्चर ऑप्शन फ्रॉम द इंसर्ट मेनू दैट कैन कंटेन्स आ बिटमैप इमेजेस स्कैन पिक्चर्स फोटोग्राफ्स क्लिप आर्ट्स एंड अदर पिक्चर्स विच इज डाउनलोडेड फ्रॉम द इंटरनेट एंड द पिक्चर्स विच इज क्रिएटेड इन एम एस पेंट फोटोशॉप एक्सेट्रा नाउ हेयर वी आर वर्किंग विथ ऑटो सेव्स इंसर्टिंग ऑटो सेव्स सो देर दिस इज द टूल वार विच यू विल गेट एट द बॉटम दैट कंटेन द मैनी ऑप्शन सो फर्स्ट इन द ऑटो सेव यू आर हैविंग द ऑप्शन call out stars and banners flow charts block arrows basic shapes and lines so mostly these types of shapes are used in designing to pamphlets or advertising materials in newspapers so you can also draw any auto shape for inserting line and after when this object is draw in your document then we can change the size of the uh, shape or we can also reduce the size of the shape suppose you have created suppose these two object one is the rectangle and second one is the circles and now we want to change in the formatting of these objects such as the size and thickness and the color filling so first we have to select this one so when we will click on any object this will be selected in this form and the small small dots will be come on the line so suppose we want to select a multiple objects then press the control key from the uh, press the shift key from the keyboard and click on the second and third object for if we are selecting these object without shift key so when we will click on the second object the first will be deselected so here this is the option for grouping and ungrouping of an object so press the shift key from the keyboard and click on the first object second object and third object so all object will be selected in this form and after that we can move these object from one place to another place or we can fill the colors and we can change the formatting such as the thickness of a line etc so in one time we can rearrange these multiples objects and after that when your formatting is completed when we want to ungroup these element then there is the option is a ungroup so just right click on these objects and select the ungroup now the next option from the drawing tool bar this is from the work art so artistic text or decorative text in your document is called the word art so when you will you can also select this option from the insert menu or you can select this one from the tool bar or uh, from the drawing tool bar also so this dialog box will be come that shows the different types of artistic design so we can select an any design then this dialog box will be come and just type uh, any text which you want in this style and click on the okay so this will be come just like in this way and this is also similar to there will be the after selection a small small rectangles or squares will be come outside of this object so word art will also work in a object we can when we will select this when the there is the four arrow mouse pointer is in four arrow so we can move this from one place to another 
place or when your mouse pointer will be in double arrow then we can increase and decrease the size of this object now here these are the some advanced option of formatting a word art so just click on that one and right click and select the format word art option so in this dialog box there will be the colors and lines size and the many options will be come so just select the appropriate option and click on the ok button or suppose we want to change the style of which which is already created in word art then there is the one option in the word art in the word art toolbar that is the word art format word art shapes here this is the option of word art shape so when you will click on this one then multiple designs will be so one just selects any design so your text will be changed in according to selected now working with the pictures and the clip art so there the option is available in the insert menu so you can select the you can click on the insert menu go to the pictures and there will be an option clip art or there will be an option insert from file so here this is the first portion that is selecting a pictures from clip art so these are the already installed in your computer when mm, the software is installed ms office in your computer and here this is display the different categories such as the backgrounds animal animals cartoons etc select the appropriate uh, category and from that category just select the particular picture and click on the insert button and you can also select the pictures from another file so just click on the insert menu then select the picture and from file and just go to the so this dialogs will be open then go to a particular drive select the files and folder so this will be shown in the preview okay this is your picture this pictures may be downloaded or uh, captures from a camera and click on the insert button when this pictures will be inserted or when the word art will be inserted in your file then this will be not move from one place to another place and this will be not a centered or right alignment so for that we required the wrapping text around graphics option this we will get on the toolbar format toolbar or you can also select so these are the multiples option which is available in the format word art option so if we are selecting the first one so the data will be from the top end and bottom and the picture will be the left alignment and here we can write cannot write so this is the square shape that will source get the text can be uh, the text can be write outside the pictures in this the text can be covers the most area that is inside the square and from this option we can write a text on a pictures and in this option we can put a pictures onto a text so just you can see this with the help of example here this is the text uh, behind pictures and here this is the in front of text this is the tight so this will be covered till here and this is the square shape so this area is blank in a rectangle shape now how you can a word points of a graphics then you can you can change the wrapping text point with the help of arrows so these are the some arrows then we can drag and drop so the size of this will be changed like this so now this is not in the tight form and not in the square shape this is the both of mixing 